Yo. Yo, so, I don't know if you can hear me, it's quite windy. Just got on half past four. Here my Sarah's up. And I've also popped up a shelter. Yo. So. What's it up? I'm under the shelter. Uh, so, chilling really. Uh, gonna cook some tea in a minute. Look, there he is, sat out here. Cook. I've just bought my uh, pocket rocket, MSR pocket rocket with me, so. Just gonna cook some stuff in the frying pan. Uh, having a beer. So, I've got a steam brew session IPA. Which is nice. It's four point nine percent. I um, I got one of these first when I was here last with the car, and um, we sell them at little other supermarkets are available. But uh, yeah, it's nice. I bought a couple of those and a couple of the. Uh, I can't remember the call, but I'll, I'll show it when I'm drinking one. So yeah, it's it's like half past five. It's it's too late to be worrying about going anywhere quite knackered but everything's set up the bed's set up so I can go in whenever uh, so I'm just gonna chill here tonight um, it's me and maybe two other people in the whole, in the whole site um, and they're all in camper vans so I think I'll be the only one brave enough to have a tent but I'm quite well sheltered down here it's not the, the spot I would necessarily have chosen but I've got to be a bit sensible when the weather's like this Yo. I'm on the floor. <laughs> so I'm uh, down here. It's just like the most comfortable place to wait to sort of lie to cook. Because that's here. Uh, but yeah, so I said I'd talk about the other beer that I had. So that's it there. So it's, it's the uh, Twisted Knots American IPA. And it's the uh, another one from the same place I mentioned earlier. Uh, and it's uh, a grapefruit aroma with notes of ze zesty, cis zesty citrus fruits. I'm not drunk, honestly, I've only had one beer. Uh, but yeah, so yeah, it's just easier to lie down on here while I'm cooking and sort of sit and try and keep leaning over. Uh, so yeah, I'm just, um, I can't listen to music and film because I'm filming on my phone. But yeah, I'm just lying here listening to music chilling out and I'm hoping that the wind doesn't get up and blow my shelter away but I think I've put it up pretty well. Right, we're going to see to the chops because that's what I've got and I shall report him in a bit. Peace out. Uh, so, it's just gone seven. That's the view. Doesn't really do it justice. Uh, but, yeah, I've eaten. I've had some beers and 
that's the setup. The shelter's up. The MSR is up. And I've, um, like an old grandma, I've got a, <laughs> I've got a, uh, a windbreaker over there as well, just to, I don't know, just help keep a bit of the wind off the tent during the night. Uh, I've, I've decided, having looked at the forecast, to take the shelter down now. Served its purpose this evening. I've sat under it, been sheltered from the wind and been able to chill out and, uh, and cook. But I've checked the forecast and there's some heavy rain forecast for about 11 o'clock. The wind is supposed to be getting up by probably another 10 miles an hour through the night. Uh, I certainly don't want that to be blowing away during the night and me'd have to get up in my boxer shorts and run after it. So I'm gonna take it down now. It's while it's dry and the wind, even though it is strong, is not that bad. Uh, I mean, up there, again, it's probably not to do it justice, but it's looking pretty grim. Uh, so I'm gonna get the shelter down now and I think it will save me some work later. Good morning. So, uh, it's about half past eight <sighs> on day two. Let's see, I'm still in the tent. As you may or may not be able to hear, it's still pretty windy out there. Uh, the top of the tent, you can see it's um, rained quite a lot through the night. Which is nice because I was able to just lie and listen to the rain. Uh, slept pretty well. So I've stopped off at Willican. It's looking pretty rough. And the, the winds are probably between 30 and 40 miles an hour, so it's not surprising. The sea is great when it's like this. somewhere sheltered to stand for a minute. Uh, well, in the shelter. <laughs> Lisa pulled up to a mile of view for a minute. Weather's strange. It was sunny a second ago and now it's absolutely hammering it down. Fortunately I happen to just be here um, where, there's, where there's a shelter and it's facing the right direction.
weather is bizarre today. Um, <laughs> I'm in yet another shelter. Just um, getting some shelter from the rain. Uh, it's heavy, heavy showers, but they literally only last seconds, some of them. hear that <laughs> but, um, people just down there and enjoying the enjoying the wind I think um, but yeah I don't know if you sort of see over there but it, it is it is really windy here View of the sea. Serious weather today, showers. It's not raining, really, it's raining, so that's cool. But, uh, there's a uh, very strong wind, so it depends on where you sat. It's how much you're affected by said wind. Uh, Nice little shelter spot here. Still have to hold on to my phone for dear life. Yo. So uh, it's about six, quarter past six, something like that. Um, back at the campsite, and looks like it's only me here. This is anyone over the top. Uh, some pretty nasty looking weather around, if you look behind me. Um, but that's, that's what I've got on its way, so I might have a bit of a respite from the rain. Uh, I'm trying to cook, it's been a bit of a nightmare. I have to keep moving the burner into the vestibule underneath the tent to stop the rain getting to it. Uh, now, I'm just doing some sausages and that'll be it. And having a beer. Yeah, just hoping that rain holds off long enough now and it should looking out there for me to finish eating. Uh, sun's due to set probably in the next half an hour. Once the sun's down I can dive into the tent and chill out. seagulls because they'll dive bomb my sausages if I'm not careful. I uh, can't believe it. But two days, like almost gone already. Well, I say two days, I've only really been here 24 hours. Uh, got overnight and then I'm gonna probably pack up early in the morning depending on the weather as to whether or not I bother doing any breakfast here and shoot over to Ilfra Coom for a bit just to chill out there uh, before Make my way back home. Morning. So it's uh, it's gone half past nine on day three. Going home day. Yeah. Yeah. So sad. This is the last time I'm going to be here this year. Look at that view. I haven't really been able to see it in the last few videos. It's just been cloudy and crap. So. It. I may, uh, may do another quick one of these in the middle of the coon, but I'll be heading home from there. So if not, peace out. <laughs>